What's up guys, Jeff with Twix here, and this is an update video, a long overdue update video about my YouTube channel, about things that have been happening with my YouTube channel, uh, because a lot of crazy stuff's been happening. Well, not crazy stuff, just things have been happening and I haven't really been explaining myself, which uh, is the purpose of this video funnily enough. So I suppose I get this done right away in a checklist style because everyone likes checklists, right? Remember lists or whatever? Yep, let's go with that. Okay, number one, my brand new Twitter account. A lot of people have been asking me what the bloody hell have I been doing lately? Um, you might notice that my Twitter account was deleted, my 1400 follower one, and I made a new Twitter account to a lot of people wondering why I've done that. Especially as it's the exact same handle as my old one. So if you want to follow my new Twitter account, it is just Jack32X. The same as my YouTube channel, same as every other network that I'm pretty much on, apart from my PSN, which is a different name for uh, various reasons. So yeah, a lot of people ask me, Jack, what are you doing? Why, why have you done this? Um, like, well, what was your motive behind this? And simply put, there was quite a lot of junk on that account. With 152,000 tweets over four years, it's safe to say that I do my fair share of tweeting and talking to a lot of people. Um, I also realized that a lot of the followers that were on there were bots and they were starting to annoy me a little bit. So I, I thought, you know what, my, my channel sort of needs picking up again. I thought this would be a good way of um, sort of gauging how many people are still engaged with my channel. Um, because th th this is this is why I have so many tweets on my account, right? I don't see um, I don't see Twitter as a social network where I'll keep like many memories on there. Um, the fact of the matter is Twitter really um, only keeps the last 3,000 tweets that you have on your account live on the website and gets rid of the rest to cache memory. It also gets rid of your pictures like after a certain amount of time anyway. With Facebook, everything stays there. So for me, Facebook as a social network is where I can put all my memories or like sort of like uh, photos I can look back on and stuff. Whereas Twitter, I see it as a quick response forum. Um, I can just post whatever and I can see who's online and chat to them. And it basically provided a quick and direct access to people who watch my videos. Now this is why things like my uh, subreddit and my Steam group have just failed catastrophically because I haven't been able to engage with anyone on there. Uh, whereas on Twitter, everyone's on Twitter and everyone seems to respond on Twitter and everyone seems to be active on Twitter. So it's just a lot easier for me to keep in contact with people, tell people about videos, tell people about events, share my videos, share my content, share other people's content and just be genuinely nice to people. It's as simple as that really. And um, with 152,000 tweets, People who were following me uh, from my YouTube channel, from um, you know, they uh, heard about me from elsewhere, just kept asking me about why have you got so many tweets on your account? That is the reason why I tweet so much, and that is the reason why I talk to people a lot on Twitter. It's just for me, it's just easier in keeping in contact with all of you guys who are watching my content. It's as simple as that. I find it much easier than any forum. I find it much easier than any subreddit. It's just easier to deal with. So yeah, that's pretty much my reason why I did that. So there's a new Twitter account. It's got the same handle, so it's Jack32X, and basically it's just like starting over for me. I got 150 followers on there. Thank you very much, uh, by the way, if you uh, follow me on my old account and follow me onto the new account. I know it's a bit weird. I know it's a bit confusing, but it made sense in my head at the time, and that's why I did it basically. And it will work out eventually. Uh, it's, it's just nice to have a sort of fresh start with that kind of thing, uh, especially as um, I'm trying to push my channel forward at the moment. And uh, obviously, uh, that brings me on to my second point too: where the bloody hell is the content? Well, <laughs> this is a—you see, this is a bit of a problem. Right? If you—if you've been checking out my channel, you notice I've been doing a lot of sort of more ser um, serious sort of journalist work for my channel uh, with Push Start Media. That is because I am uh, a PC video reviewer for these guys um, officially now. Yep, it's a, it's a, you know, obviously it's a voluntary position, but whatever, it's still cool. Um, and I actually have a lot of games that I need to cover in that time. Of course, with my actual full-time job, this makes things very difficult. At the moment, my room is um, empty, completely empty. I'm sitting on a box while recording this, actually, on my computer, because it's in the middle of being redecorating. And honestly, uh, when I come back from a nine-hour uh, shift at work, or if you like include gym or whatever, I am damn knackered, and the last thing I want to do is sit on a box and stare at another screen at the moment. I'm trying to make it as comfortable as possible so that I actually have the motivation to make videos. It sounds really lame, I know, but honestly, it's starting to sort of wear me down a bit now. It's just getting on my nerves. I, I, I just want to sit down on a nice comfy chair and get on with my work, and I just can't do that at the moment. So um, there's a backlog of videos for Push Start Media. Um, I will be continuing doing these, and they will still be integrated onto the Jack32X channel. Why? Because it's just a nicer way of me uh, managing the content on there and pushing it forward to other people. I, I can't be bothered to have a separate channel for the push start stuff and, you know, the, the funnier sort of parody stuff. I'd rather just set it into two big playlists, which I'm in the process of doing in the next few weeks, uh, and then just setting my homepage to that. The homepage will also, uh, you know, the actual home channel page, uh, we'll see a bit of an overhaul. I'm trying to work on some new channel art. Uh, Google, for some strange reason, has completely botched my channel art. 
and has made it like really bright and overexposed and really pixely and it's completely ruined the look of it and it's just annoying no matter what i do because I, I can't find the ps uh, the P psd file anymore because uh, my computer's been wiped so many times uh, it's, that's a horrid story i'll get to that some other time um yeah, so I, you know, I can't access the PSD, so I can't edit the file, and Google has, like, a really bad upload limit, and it doesn't work. So, I'm going to be working on that from scratch, as well as a new outro slide. I realize the outro slides are a bit hit and miss, but I feel that some of my videos sort of just end abruptly, and I thought, you know what, having an outro slide, and then having a little bit of music and whatever, uh, sort of rounded off my videos quite nicely, in fact, and uh, that's something I'd like to return again. Of course, I can't use my current outro slide, because it's got the Jacksville thing on there, and that's still not happening, because... I haven't been able to sort anything out. I've been so busy. Um, but yeah, the push start content, basically, there's a, a backlog of videos that need to come out soon, uh, including free video reviews and a first look video. Uh, those are in production right now. Um, I'm just, just getting some recording clips here and there again. I, I'm kind of going for a transitional phase at the moment because obviously I have no room, technically. It's just an empty space at the moment for a, a good few weeks. So you have to bear with me on that one, guys, but content is definitely coming soon. Also, um, while that takes priority over my uh, before I can do like funny stuff again, uh, there will be one parody redub video that I will be doing before this content because um, I feel that it's relevant right now. And that is the um, Call of Duty Advanced Warfare trailer, which I've got some really cool ideas for. It was suggested by um, Phoenix GG2 that I parody it, so why not? I'm, it's about time I did a parody. And I thought, you know what, this one takes priority because uh, obviously if I miss the, the, miss the jump with this one, it's just going to bomb and people aren't going to get jokes sort of thing. Um, you got to time these things just right, and that's why I think my Xbox One video did so well, because I timed it just right. Uh, but, like, all my other parodies I've sort of got wrong, <laughs> which is a bit of a fail. But um, I'll be working on that tomorrow, actually. I am starting production on that tomorrow. I've got the trailer. I've got it in HD, finally. I'm sick of getting a ripped video that's in the worst resolution possible. I've actually got it in full 1080p, which is, uh, which is great. Um, so I can actually start work on that. Don't know how much trouble I'll get uh, with Activision if I try monetizing. I probably won't monetize it because I'm not like that. But, uh, you know, it'll be fun to do. Um, I'm, yeah, definitely ready for that. I've got um, some really cool ideas for it. So hopefully you guys will enjoy that. I'll see if I can get it done on the Monday. It's, thank God it's a bank holiday. At least I have a day to work on it. Um, so, yeah, yeah, that, that's about it. Number three, number three, number three. The Postal 2 series, which has just plagued my life for the last six months. Um... If people haven't been following this, basically I agreed to deal with Running With Scissors, who are the developers of Postal 2, to create a, a series of videos where I give away a copy of Postal 2 Complete in each episode. Um, that still hasn't happened, I know, it's coming up to five, six months since that was agreed upon. But this is also about the same time frame when I started my work, and things have not been going smoothly for the project. Um, basically what was happening is that I had this idea, but was, the, the game's played out over seven days, and I was trying to make ten episodes out of that. Uh, so I was going to go with one episode per day and then look at some mod content, like Steam Workshop content and multiplayer. And I actually have some pre-release episodes complete, uh, four of them in fact. But what I noticed when I ran them back was that I was just basically saying the same joke on all four, like just saying the same thing on all four episodes. And it became a real drag and I didn't really enjoy doing it. Um, so I've shelved those episodes. That doesn't mean I'm not going to be doing it. Uh, I will still get to work on it. But I'm just going to have to redo the scripts, I think, and uh, like really look into how to uh, make that one work. Because honestly, looking at it back, it was like watching episode one four times. It, it was annoying, and I knew people were going to pick up on the fact that the jokes would, would have been recycled. I got, I've got to think of something inventive, basically, um, which is obviously, uh, you know, uh, not impossible. It's just that right now, with things that are happening, I'm, I might have to put that on the back burner. But um. You know, rest assured that I'll still be trying to get that done. If you're, of course, interested in the Postal 2 stream, Postal 2 is a quite an offensive game, but it's hilarious at the same time as well. And uh, that's cleared a lot of things up, actually. The you know, um, if you notice, I've shut down my Tumblr pretty much. It came back on today, but I'm shutting it down again. I'm, I'm done with that. I'm done with the whole blog thing. Um, it just doesn't work out. There are people on there who just uh, just witch hunting, and um, frankly, I just can't be bothered with that anymore. Um... I'd just rather focus on the videos, which is the whole point of my YouTube channel, rather than focusing on what people thought of me. Um, so is that, uh, I think that's all basic. Uh, that's three points, so there's not really an in-depth... Well, it's coming up to ten minutes, but, you know, uh, I didn't really think this through. I'm basically speaking right now like it's all coming to me as I'm doing this. So, yeah, basically, I am sorry that, like, the lack of content on my channel. I really am. Um, 
it's just been it's been frustrating for me i've gotten quite angry about it actually um because I, I do enjoy it i still do enjoy it i've been doing this for four years now and i had some spots this year where i just thought is it worth me continuing is it worth me carrying on um because obviously it's just a hobby and i just thought yeah you know i've still got i've still got to have a hobby i love my job i i, I love what i'm doing at the moment uh, it's something to do. Should be going to the gym is pretty cool as well because it's just something to do and uh, something that I've actually been able to stick out and I'm rather proud of it. Um, I'm still, I'm still large, but that way I'm still, I've still got a long way to go before I, I feel comfortable with like my progress. But um, I'm still enjoying it. I'm enjoying sticking at it. And um, but I want to stick out the videos as well, of course. Um, so yeah, rest assured, I am trying to work things out and I'm trying to get stuff done. I'm definitely trying to in uh, upgrade the internet connection as well. That is just a major pain. The upload speed I've got is absolutely awful at the moment. And so that, that really kills my sort of motivation to get stuff done. Um, I've got the computer to do it now. I've got the computer to like sort of render stuff in 1080p, no problem at all, like really quickly as well. I was just stuck there uploading it all all day, all weekend. It's just it's just a, it's just a killer. Um, but. You know, rest assured, I will uh, get some more content done. I am really sorry that I didn't explain this to people sooner. Um, didn't explain why I changed my Twitter account sooner. I didn't explain um, the fact that my channel is split between uh, the, the stuff that I like have fun with, um, parodies and whatever, and serious uh, journalist uh, content for Push Start. Which I also love doing. That, that is the, that is like the sort of dream for me. If I could be like, imagine that hired as a video reviewer for someone like someone major, that'd be. I mean, it's just something I want to do. Uh, I, I enjoy that. So that's why those two style of videos are appearing at the channel, and that's why you see the push dot videos have all the push dot assets to them, and they've got the links correct. To, you know, they're like they're proper um, videos, and they're all viewable on push dot. By the way, once they're uploaded, so. I recommend you check out the website, of course, because technically I'm like PC video reviewer guy. Hooray. We've got another one as well, which is awesome. I'll shout out this channel in the description because I'm I'm nice like that. Uh, this is a video that's rolling on right now. So, yeah, just to recap, new Twitter account. Uh, shut, pretty much like shutting down my Tumblr. That's gone. Kaput. Working on videos. There's a backlog of push dot content to go, but there's one parody video that will be prioritized, and that's Call of Duty Advanced Warfare, which is the dullest sounding name the most unimaginative title for a new Call of Duty I could ever think, possibly think of, other than a numbered sequel. Uh, good, good going for that. Uh, I've got some really cool jokes for that. That hopefully will go down well. Uh, so yeah, that is it. I, you all know my name by now, my tag, whatever. So um, yeah, I will see you next time. And I am really sorry that I have not been able to uh, push more content out sooner. But I, you know. My fingers are crossed. I'm trying to get stuff done as quick as I can. So uh, you have to bear with me. See you next time.